Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be showing you how to make all of these modded outfits in GTA 5 Online. So I hope you enjoy these and if you do, I'd really appreciate it if you were to leave a like down below. But it is up to you and if you're new here, feel free to subscribe too. Uh, but that's all up to you. Um, I would appreciate it though. But yeah, that's enough talking. I hope you enjoy and shout out to all of these people on screen for commenting hashtag TJRH on my last video. Quickly, if you would like any of these services, be sure to check out the link in the description and you can use my code TJRH for 5% off your order. Also, check out a new giveaway site if you would like to win any of these uh, prizes. They have some awesome ones such as Xbox Series X's, uh, PS5's or stuff like that. So the link will be in the description for this. So let's get back into the video. Okay, so with all that being said, let's get right into the video. So to begin with this glitch, you want to first come to any clothing store on the map. It does not matter which one, just go to any clothing store and you want to make sure you put a required amount of money inside of your bank. So I'll have it on the screen now. And once you have done so, you want to make sure you equip the outfit you would like to keep as by doing a glitch, it will delete all your saved outfits. So by equipping the one you want to keep, you can actually keep that one. And then you can either delete them all yourself or by doing a glitch, they get deleted anyway. And then after you do so, open up your pause menu, go to swap character. By the way, for this glitch to work, you will need your main character to be in the first slot and it needs to be a male. And uh, if it isn't, it won't work. And then from here, you need to make a new female character in the right slot. And by the way, if it is a male in the right, you can just change it in the editing section, uh, which will we'll be on in a moment. Um, but if you do get this alert, just accept this alert and then you'll be loaded into the editing bit. Make sure it is a female. Hit save and continue. Uh, name the character anything. Then take the picture and you'll load it into a public session. Uh, but you will have to go for a cutscene. It's only a short one though, so uh, just wait. Once you do load in though, make sure you enable passive mode so no one can mess you up whilst you're doing a glitch. And after you do this, you need to open up your map and see if you have any clothing stores. If you do, go to one. If you don't, find a new session and it will appear on your map. And then just go to one. Once you arrive at a clothing store, go inside, you want to go to the accessories menu over at the back of the store. And over here, you just want to go onto it and remove any accessories on your outfit. So most standard outfits come with earrings. Um, as you can see, they did, so take them off. And if you see any other accessories like wristbands or watches or anything, take those off too. And that's it. So I'll skip to when I've made all the outfits just to make it a bit easier and quicker. Um, but don't worry, I'll go in depth on what to equip. Uh, but yeah, I'll see you in a moment. So first of all, we have the blue outfit with the CEO vest uh, from the thumbnail. So this one consists of two different outfits on the female. And the first one, you want to head over to gloves on the accessories menu. So head over to gloves. Once you're over here, go down obviously onto gloves and you want to purchase the light woodland armored gloves. So these ones here, the light woodland armored. After you've done so, head up to earrings on accessories also and you want to equip the BMW deco earrings. So these here, after you have these, so you want to head over to pants. And over on pants, go down to utility pants and you want to equip the uh, black battle pants. So these here, after you have done this though, go onto the tops menu just behind you. And on this, go on biker cuts and you want to equip the washed denim cut. So this one here, the washed denim cut. After you have done this, uh, you want to head down to bikinis. And on bikinis, equip the black bikini. So this one here, number 27 I believe it is. After you've done this though, you want to open up your interaction menu, go to inventory, body armor, and you want to show heavy armor. Uh, this is so you can get the CEO vest armor on your outfit on the mail. Uh, if you don't have this, it won't work, so you need to make sure you put on the heavy armor. And uh, save this in slot number two at the front counter. Uh, name this blue one, so the same as I do. And by the way, when we're doing all of these, make sure you name them the same as I do. Otherwise, you'll be confused uh, later in the video. But anyway, for the second blue outfit, you want to make sure you keep everything the same, uh, except for the pants and the shoes. So keep the top and everything else the same and the gloves, except you want to head over to pants, go on to sports pants and equip the first one. So the spotted muscle uh, pants, these ones here, the first ones. After you have these, so all you need to do is head over to shoes. And over on shoes, go on to high heel boots. You want to purchase the cream ankle boots. So these here, cream ankle boots. After you have these though, uh, again, you want to make sure you have the heavy armor 
on. So open up your interaction menu, uh, menu inventory, body armor, and you want to show heavy armor as it might have come off when you equip the new uh, pants and stuff. But yeah, after you have this, you want to go to the front counter, save this in slot number three, uh, name it blue two. Anyway, that's a blue outfit done. So now moving on to the galaxy outfit. Uh, this consists of two different outfits on the female. So for the first one, you want to keep the gloves the same. So the light woodland armor to keep those on. Uh, but you want to head over to pants. And over here, go on jeans. You want to purchase the black cropped jeans. So these just down here. And after you equip these, head over to shoes. Over on shoes, go on high heel boots. You want to purchase a deluxe midnight combat boots. So these here. After you have this though, you want to head over to tops just behind you. And then on tops, go down to leather bomber jackets and purchase a multicolor SN leather bomber. Um, it might be open for you. If it is, open up your interaction menu and set the style to closed. So make sure it is closed. And after you've done that, you want to head over to hats just next to you here. Uh, and on this, go on canvas hats. You want to purchase the one second to last. So this one here, the grey blade canvas hat. Uh, this is for the checkered hat, by the way. If you don't want it, you don't have to equip this. And then head over to glasses. And for the checkered glasses, you want to go on casual glasses and purchase the copper marbles. So number 22. After you've done so, uh, go to the front counter and save this in slot number 4. And name this galaxy 1. After you've done this, uh, for the Galaxy 2 outfit, you want to keep everything the same except for the top, so head over to tops, you want to go down to work jackets and purchase a peach camo closed field, so this one here. After you have this though, you want to head down to tucked t-shirts and then over here, purchase a blue digital t-shirt number 75. And that's it for this one, so go back to the front counter, save this in slot number 5, name it Galaxy 2. And then that's it for the Galaxy outfits. Now moving on to the checkerboard outfit, this also consists of two different outfits on the female as you can see, so checkered one and two. For the first one you want to head over to uh, tops, because as you can see you want to keep the pants, shoes and gloves the same. And on this you want to go down to sports tops and purchase a grey racerback sports top. And then that's it for this one, so keep the checkered hat and glasses on if you do want those. And then go back to the front counter, save this in slot number six and name it checkered one. And that is it for the first check-in outfit, so for the second one, again we're going to keep the pants, shoes, gloves, hat and glasses the same, except for the top, you want to head over to tops, go, go down to sports jackets and purchase a sea green puffer jacket, so this one here, number 99. And after you have this, you want to go down to bustiers, then on bustiers, equip the white lace bustier, so the white lace bustier, after you have this, so go back to the front counter and save this in slot number 7. So slot number 7, I'll name it Checkered 2. And that's literally it for the checkered outfit, it's quite easy. And now we're moving on to the yellow uh, Tron outfit with the yellow sort of joggers or cargo joggers. Uh, but for this one, it consists of two different outfits on the female also. Uh, but for the first one, keep the gloves the same. So the gloves on all these outfits are the same. But on this you want to go to uh, pants and go on sports pants, equip the first one, so the spotted muscle pants. After you have that though, you want to head over to tops just behind you. Go down to her biker cuts and equip number 50, so the patched darted vest. Then after you have this, head over to shoes. And this is the last bit for this outfit. On shoes, go down to go on boots. And go down to the black slack boots and equip these. After you have equipped these though, what you want to do is go to the front counter and save this in slot number 8. So save it in slot number 8 and name it um, yellow 1. Anyway, moving on to the yellow 2 outfit. All this is is the same as the last one, except change the top. So go on to tops, go down to work jackets and equip the peach camo closed field. After you have this though, go down to tucked t-shirts and purchase a blue digital t-shirt number 75. And that is it for this one, so go to the front counter, save this in slot number 9 and name it yellow 2.
and that is it for all the outfits so I'll go over them slow uh, and make sure they are the, you have the same ones as I do. Okay, so once you make sure they are the same as mine, just take the easy way out using your interaction menu. And this will force the game to save, by the way. But once you do load back out on foot, you want to open up your pause menu and start up creator. In the creator menu, you want to start up a new land race, so create a race and uh, make a new land race. You will have to fill in the race details though, so the title, description and photo don't really matter, you can do anything for those. Uh, but what you do want to do, what does matter, is you want to set a maximum players to 3 and set a route type to point to point. But after you do this, uh, if you want to make this process a little bit quicker, uh, you can choose any supercar or F1 car to do the race quicker. And then from here, uh, warp over to the airport. At the airport you want to uh, place a trigger anywhere, it doesn't really matter, and um, place a lobby camera, take a photo of anything. But once you do both of those you will need to place weight, uh, checkpoints until the race length is a certain distance, so uh, you'll see the bottom right you'll have a red triangle. Once that goes away uh, you can now test the race, so uh, place checkpoints until it goes away and then test the race. Once you have tested the race, you'll get this alert saying you've completed it, so you want to accept this alert and then open up your pause menu and head over to online, choose character. And once you load into this menu, just delete your female character. After you have deleted her, all you need to do uh, is you actually want to press B or circle to return to story mode so go straight back into story mode don't go into online or else it won't work then once you load into story mode start up a new online invite only session When you load in, you'll notice you have the outfit on that you chose to keep at the beginning, so what you want to do, you want to go to the front counter and save this outfit, but save it out of the way of the others, so to the bottom slot number 20. So save it to slot number 20, and by the way, you'll notice all the other outfits from the female have transferred over. And for this first one, we will need the CEO vest outfit, so I'll show you how to get it now. First of all, you want to head over to this clothing store on the map. And then over here, make sure you open up your interaction menu. And you want to make sure your spawn location is set to last location. And then go up to hide option, set the jobs to custom. So you'll see the blue jobs appear on your map. There'll be one right outside of this clothing store. And from here, you need to register as a CEO. And then go to management style. And then click the LFA outfit. So this one here with the CEO vest. And then after you have this, go on this blue circle next to you. And press right D-pad to start it up. When you load in, it doesn't matter if you're the host or not, just uh, make sure it starts up. And when you are in this first menu, click confirm and continue. Uh, but in the second one, wait a few seconds and then quit the job. When you load in, you want to run into the clothing store and press right D-pad on any of the menus. And then wait on here until you get kicked off the menu. When you do get kicked off the menu, you'll see you have the outfit back on. Now retire from your CEO and you'll still have it. So from here, head, of, head over to the accessories menu. And then over on accessories, you want to equip whichever gloves you want with the outfit. So 
and you can equip the black woolen gloves or some blue ones or whatever you want I'm going for the black ones uh, but it's up to you and if you do want a black desert scarf or a scarf on your outfit to transfer over but you, you will have to use your interaction menu to equip it uh, but it is optional you don't have to if you don't want to have the scarf on your outfit but yeah from here you need to start with crooked cops so to do this open up your pause menu go to jobs play jobs rockstar created versus and start up crooked cop In this menu, all you want to do is set the clothing to player owned and then you need to invite anyone and start this up. When you load in, you want to go down to owned outfit, scroll two to the right, you'll notice you have this outfit, so the blue sports jacket uh, and also the CEO vest. So now just ready up. You load in, I forgot to say, but you do need an earpiece for this bit, so if you don't have an earpiece and you are following along, you can just quit a job, go to an ammunition store, uh, buy an earpiece from the gear section, and then just do the same thing again, go in Crooked Cop. Uh, but if you do already have an earpiece, just open up your interaction menu and go to Style, Accessories, equip your earpiece. Once you have done so, uh, you need to get in any vehicle and then go down to the clothing store in the mission. Uh, you don't need to, it's just so you spawn closer when you quit a job. But once you're at a clothing store, all you need to do is make sure your earpiece is still equipped so just check it's still there in your ear and then quit the job through using your phone and then when you load it you'll notice you have your outfit so go into a clothing store inside of the clothing store you can either remove your earpiece or keep it on it doesn't really matter it's up to you and then go to the front counter and save this outfit but you want to save it at the bottom so to slot number 19 out of the way of all the others so you can make the other outfits as well but yeah save it at the bottom after you have saved it you need to delete the two outfits you used to make this one so delete blue one and blue two so just make sure they are both deleted and then for the next one which is a galaxy outfit um, equip the gloves you would like on the outfit so if you do want uh, biker gloves go down to biker suits and purchase a black biker suit or any of these whichever gloves you want really and then after you have this uh, you want to open up your pause menu jobs play jobs rockstar created versus and then start up crooked cop and in this menu go down to clothing set it to player owned and then just invite anyone and start this up Inside of this menu though, go down to old outfit, scroll two to the right and you'll see you have the galaxy outfit so from here just ready up. Inside of the job just equip your earpiece through using your interaction menu, uh, go to style accessories and equip your earpiece. After you do this you can go to the clothing store uh, using one of these vehicles. And then over at the clothing store, uh, make sure your earpiece is still equipped. And then just quit a job for using your phone. When you load in, you'll notice you have the outfit from the job. Now just go over to the clothing store. Inside of here, you can either remove your earpiece or keep it on. Either way, it doesn't matter, it's just what you want to do. And then go to the front counter. Over here, save this at the bottom, so to slot number 18, and uh, name it whatever you want to. Uh, but after it is saved, delete the two ones you used to make this, so delete Galaxy 1 and Galaxy 2. And then next up we have the checkerboard outfit, so for this one you want to, again, equip the gloves you want on the outfit. So uh, if you don't want biker gloves, go to biker suits and equip the black biker suit, uh, or any other ones depending on the gloves you want. But after you have this, start up Crooked Cop, so do the same again and just start it up.
and then in this menu set a clothing to player owned and then invite anyone and start this up. When you load in, go down to own outfit, scroll two to the right and you'll see you have the checkerboard outfit. So from here, ready up. And inside of here, uh, clip an earpiece through using your interaction menu and then head over to the clothing store in the mission. Over here, make sure your earpiece is still equipped and then quit the job through using your phone. When you load in, go back into the clothing store. Inside of here, either keep your earpiece on or remove it, it's up to you. And then you want to go to the front counter. And then over here, save the outfit at the bottom, so I believe slot number 17 this time. And then just delete the two ones you used to make this, so check at one and check at two. Now that leaves us to the final outfit, which is the yellow Tron one. So for this one, all you want, all you, all you want to do is head over to pants. And on this, go on cargo pants and then equip the sand cargoes. After you have the sand cargoes equipped, all you want to do is go up to shoes. And you want to equip any boots that tuck uh, the pants into them. So you'll get this sort of jogger looking um, pants. But after you do this, go on to tops. You want to go down to racing jerseys. And equip the one that gives you the yellow and black gloves. So this one here. After you have this though, uh, start up crooked cop. Now in this menu, set a clothing to player owned and then invite anyone and start this up. When you load in, you want to go down to old outfit, scroll two to the right and you'll notice you have this yellow Tron outfit with a yellow kind of cargo joggers and also yellow Tron shoes or deadline shoes, whatever you want to call it, uh, but ready up. And uh, when you load in, uh, open up your interaction menu and equip your earpiece. But once you do, uh, go to the clothing store in the mission. And then over here, make sure your earpiece is still equipped, but quit the job through using your phone. When you load in, you want to go back into the clothing store. Inside of here, either keep your earpiece on or remove it, it's up to you completely. And then go to the front counter and save this outfit. But after you do save it, you can delete the two you used to make this, it doesn't matter. Uh, because we have made all the outfits now. Um, so you can either delete them or keep them, it doesn't matter. And uh, that's all for outfits, so I hope you enjoyed. Obviously, uh, you can customise these as you wish if you want to add helmets or if you add the yellow rebreather or colored rebreathers feel free to do that or whatever you want to do but yeah that's this one done so i hope you enjoyed i hope you enjoyed these outfits too and if you made it this far into the video um comment suburban down below um but yeah just comment that down below and i'll try and heart your comment anyway though i hope you enjoyed have an awesome day or night and i'll see you in the next one take care